this is a redo of uh, my last video, and it was on Bark Lord's thing. So basically, uh, Gary came to my stickum last night, and he mentioned that um, about the Bark Lord video. Boo Boo Tube had made a comment in another video of mine about the Bark Lord cult video. And then in the middle of stickum, I, I took a half an hour and watched it, and and uh, Gary had come back towards the end of that. And you always say, do you think that's appropriate? And I'm kind of like, well, I'm surprised Barklord would go there considering Barklord and et cetera, et cetera. But I'm telling him, look, I've been accused of somehow being a cult as well. And it just, you know, it's just not that big of a deal. And I started pointing out to Gary, well, Gary, you call me things that are way beyond the pale. You know, like, well, but this is different. This is, you know, you're telling people they can't think for themselves. And I'm like, Gary, you know, you, you call me and I specifically said child abuser just for having kids, you know, and that, it's no worse to be called uh, a cult member, and you go, well, it's not true, well, it's not true, I'm a child abuser too, you're making a simile, a hyperbolic simile, but in that, Gary's whole thing would, no, I've, I've objectively proven that about you, and then he said what he had called me, that I didn't want to be the one to bring it up, and then again, he immediately did that, I'm a child molester, well, that's ridiculous, because what we're really saying, I could take insults, great, but what we're really saying is that I'm a child endangerer, that by having kids, I brought them into a dangerous world, and that's endangerment. So you're saying it's like I'm sending my kid out to the store uh, at 10 o'clock at night, and they have to go through, you know, rapist park to get there, and it's 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 torturing them because they're petrified and sometimes get raped, and that would still be hyperbolic, right? But it would sort of be on the point. But instead, you have to go child molester, like I'm the one in the park preying on the kids, like I'm putting them in there. For, so that they'll have that, you know, totally don't acknowledge all the work I have to do in my life to try to keep my kids or other people's kids safe, you know, and he's just out now, well, I've directly proven that's, a, oh, really? No, 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 no. Yeah, you know, you got, your class is clickish behavior, it's nothing like a cult, really, and Gary's not really got what it takes to, to do the duplicitousness that really takes to make that into an actual cult, a Jim Jonesy thing. But these similarities, you're saying I'm like a child molester. Yeah, I think we can go, hey, this clickishness, because I, personally I think a lot of these people that are huge in Menham fans are, you know, yeah, they don't think for themselves. They parrot your insults. I get called child molester and bullshit by them just because they're brainlessly, you know, parroting your shit, and then you're going to go, people should be careful and not call us a cult. Maybe you should not act like it. I mean, I got called a cult and it was like, there was no issue. I, I couldn't get on and make a video defending the person accused because there was no person. It was just one of those random things of like, well, you have a channel and people watch these videos and they're disagreeing with me, so it's a cult. But, you know, maybe the truth hurts in your case. You know, maybe you should consider that. You know, I'm willing to look at this stuff reasonably, but I'm supposed to look at reasonably like, well, maybe that was too much, and blah, blah, blah. And, and But you're calling me a child molester. I'm going to go, oh, well, but that's fine. And So I'm supposed to take really good care of you. You know, you guys can call us whatever you want, but we shouldn't call you. We should have standards because we're the people with standards. We're ethical, and you're just crazy, you know, shit-throwing monkeys. Why should you have to not throw shit at your monkeys, that's what you do, but we are, we're human, so we don't do that, so we should have a standard, you can call me a child molester, and expect that I'm going to go, nobody should even raise, you know, the, any questions about your group dynamics, well, sorry, you know, no, you guys think you're on the high horse, and you're, you're calling me child molester, and other people, all of these names, and now you've gotten to the point that I warned you about where you're fantasizing about killing all life on earth and you don't realize how heinous that is you know that that's you could we could people could be bringing up words like psychotic you know so but you expect to be immune from all of that you come and call bullshit on everybody else and but cast dispersions that you don't you know are metaphorical, but you cast them, and then you have idiot little cluckers that just take that shit literally. I get PMs from people thinking I'm an Ayn, Ayn Randian devotee because they assumed I have different politics than you because I don't want to kill everything on Earth. And I'm trying to point out, um, let's talk about some of these other things, you know? There's other important issues. No! Yeah, this issue is consuming you. It's making you fucking 
it's taking you down to the level of all these parrots that are around going, yeah, you, yeah, you're cruel. And People calling me a child molester, denying that I have compassion, claiming the high road of compassion, they want to kill everything. That's fucking sick to most of us. You're being treated with kit gloves and you don't even realize it. You don't treat us with kit gloves. And then you get something just medium level, some guy that's been harassed and insulted by you to the nth degree as I have been makes a civil non-cussing, hey, here's some similarities, I think it's a problem. And I, you should be spending your time figuring out why you're a child molester. I shouldn't figure out why you feel that our group acts like a cult. Well, fuck you, man. Your, your values are all screwed up. I care about the people that are sick, the kids with encephalitis, so let's kill everything, and you're a child molester. Yeah. Well, fuck you, get your sanity together, right? We, we already treat you with kid gloves. I already take a unidirectional series of insults. Uh, what, what, and you expect more now? You expect me to defend you from people's insults? Or disagree? No, I want you to be challenged. You call everybody every shit under the sun, you should be challenged with even random accusations. Let alone one where he's going through and frankly the cruelest thing about Bark Lord's video is yeah, that was a fan video she made. If I was online making a fan video to Jimi Hendrix and he happened to have a you know, YouTube channel, it'd probably seem embarrassing as well. Um, but in terms of, yeah, her getting emotional supply and feedback and answer to a depression and connection, that stuff's all there. You could just face it. Just fucking face it. Because it's all there a lot more than any evidence or notion that I'm a child abuser because I think life can be... Uh, made better for all of us, right? So, yeah, kiss my ass. Bark Lord is telling you something you obviously should listen to. Because look at the way you're going to all gather. Oh, this is this is an appropriate way to treat someone of our group, and you don't have any of that. You don't care how you guys treat anybody else. So screw you. You're on your own. You know? Fuck. I have to be called a child molester, and I'm like, oh well, fucking idiot has a crazy idea. Let's go on. And you're going to go. No, I'm butthurt about me. Maybe it's a, yeah, whatever.